2018 calendar class is in the game. Let's go. All right, I would like to take a quick moment to thank Zach on Twitter. I couldn't make this video without him, and I'll probably have to wait like another month to make this video if it wasn't for him. So th thank you, thank you, thank you, Zach. All right, there's something magical about hitting right there. Whew. New class in the inventory. Let's go. All right, let's grab the hood for it, the armor for it. I don't want the cape for it. I'm not going to use the cape. And I'm not gonna use the daggers either, but we will have the class now on the design house It says a luck enhancement, so I will full luck enhance it and grind it up If I see anything interesting while I'm grinding, I will tell you about that Otherwise, I will see you once I get to rank 10. We need to get the rank 10 for the 15% Critical chance. I'm pretty sure it's crit sheds. Let me quickly uh, Increase crit. Yeah by 15% so we're gonna get the rank 10 and then I'll be back with you guys shortly Alright, quite a bit of time has passed, and I got the class to rank 10, which grants me the 15% crit increase. So, as my time went on using the class, first off, ranking it up and getting your 5th skill takes the longest, because you're not doing barely any damage. I mean, you're doing a decent amount of damage, but you can't even heal until you get your 5th skill. At least, I don't, I don't think you can. Keep in mind, I've only used this class for a few hours. I don't know every little thing about it, so if I make a mistake, uh, please correct me in the comment section and put your opinion about the class in the comment section as well. This is just a first impressions video. I will have a more in-depth video once I get more time to use the class. I'm just here to show you guys what the class is like right now in case you don't have access to it because it's not purchasable for ACs in the game yet. It's only if you have a calendar code and uh, people, a lot of people, including myself, have not receive their calendar codes yet so let's get in to actually showing you how the class works in game there we go finally i hit the crit all right so how you do that nuking is really easy all you do is stack your fist skill your fist skill is stacking up so i'm just gonna do it to five just to be safe you know lag and all that so we're at three, so two more times, four, actually it might be at four already, so maybe this will be six stacks, I don't know. Uh, it only, it stacks, it caps stacks, so there's no point in doing it, there you go, see, 37k. There is how you nuke, it'll do, uh, I've hit it as low as 25k, and as high as 75k, I'm sure it goes higher than that, or lower than that, and it doesn't guarantee a nuke every time, I've, it does not, it definitely, okay, yeah, I should have healed there, uh, it definitely doesn't guarantee a nuke, so keep that in mind. Uh, the class, I'm using full luck, and uh, yeah, that's about all I have to say about the class. I showed you how the nuke with it, which that's the most important part of a calendar class, is hitting the big damage. Uh, that's why most people buy the calendar class. And uh, yeah, it's really good. It's got consistent DPS, and it's really fun to use. That's what more can I say about the class. Like, it's definitely worth the 6k AC uh, if you want to spend that, although I'd recommend getting the calendar instead, because the calendar, of course... Grants you the items in the other games, uh, along with, I think it gives you both versions of the in-game class. I'm not sure if they're going to do that. I think they did that last year. I wonder if they're going to recolor. See, see, yeah, I hit it there. Nothing happened. Uh, because sometimes it just doesn't hit because it's a luck-based class. And sometimes your luck runs out and you don't hit the skill when you should. And then other times, yeah, it's 16k there. So yeah, you gotta get lucky and actually hit the critical for it to do a nuke, but uh, otherwise it'll do consistent really high damage. And I was farming mobs with it, and it was fun just to stack up the 5 skill in one mob and then transfer over to the other and just insta hit them. Uh, that was really fun to do, but probably not a good farming class. I recommend sticking with a multi-target over this, and it's just for ease of use and not having to pay too much attention when you are farming. 21k non-crit right there. And uh, I'll leave it right with that to end this video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Tell me, again, tell me your thoughts on this class. I'm curious to know in the comments. And uh, yeah, there'll be a more in-depth guide once I get more time using the class. And uh, I get the little ins and outs of every skill and all that stuff. But uh, this has just been a first impressions for me. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. If you did, leave a like, subscribe. If you're not, 
already and i'll see you guys all in the next one peace good luck if you're farming the class points i'll see you guys all in the next one Bye bye